welcome to today's video, which is just going to be a week in my life. I am looking like a weirdo standing in my doorway to my back porch right now, but this is good lighting. So I wanted to just come introduce the video, start off the vlog. Um, I forgot to film this morning as, you know, a usual Monday morning. I was all over the place, but it's been pretty productive. To map out what my Monday looked like, I had a staff meeting at 9 a.m. So I woke up at seven this morning, worked on a video, got ready, was at the office by nine. So yeah, we are actually moving offices. We're now going to be renting an office inside of like a bigger center downtown, which is really exciting for our nonprofit organization. It's very small. So anything like this is pretty exciting. <laughs> Oops, there goes my dogs. Love that. My dogs bark at the deer every day. This is what it's like living out in the country, guys. Poor deer just get freaking scared off every day. Poor guys. Anyways, hopefully my dogs aren't continuously barking in the rest of this clip, but as I was saying, um, I just spent, spent the rest of the day there packing up and doing some things like that. And then at about 3.30, I had to go out to Best Buy to pick up a telephone. So we have to get a phone line installed where our new office is and we needed a phone. I went and staples and got some ink for our new printer and just ran some like business errands and then after that i went in target and i did purchase a few things for myself so i will do a target haul possibly so you guys i know would love that everyone loves a good target haul um so i'll show you guys what i got from there but yeah now it is late for dinner time for my dogs so they are like what the heck are you doing get off the camera and feed me so that's what i'm gonna do now is feed the dogs and then my parents are coming over to watch the bachelor tonight because us three usually watch it together so i'm gonna make dinner for them tonight and we're gonna watch the bachelor i'm gonna try to also get in a quick little workout at least just like a little dumbbell workout um before they get here as well so got a lot going on today but that is the update we got archie this like ball thing to make him eat a little slower because he was literally eating in like almost 30 seconds it was crazy um it works but it's a little more messy and he ends up like scooting his whole stand out from the wall so love that for me having to clean up and push that back every single day but it's all right Okay, quick little Target haul to start off this vlog. I got a lot of stuff. Actually, they had really cute stuff in there. And they had a couple of Target Circle offers. So if you don't know, you can be like a Target Rewards member basically called Target Circle and you can get like coupons and stuff on their app. The first thing that I got is for our house. As you can see, I've been like spring decorating and stuff. My dog's kind of messed up the pillows. So I completely redid our master bedroom. I put a quilt on there. Our white down comforter was just getting so dirty from the dogs just jumping up there whenever they wanted to. So I was like, mm, let's just get a quilt. It's easier to wash and dry like consistently. So that's what we did and it is like a mauve color. And so I wanted a little pillow to match. So I got this one from Target. It matches perfectly. It looks so good. Um, the colors definitely washed out here, but hopefully I'll be able to fix it. I love the little tassels. It's so cute and it's actually really like comfortable too if you did want to like lay on it. Super cute. This was like 20 bucks. So I got this um, Neutrogena Body Clear Body Wash in the pink grapefruit. I've had this before. It's supposed to like clear body breakouts. My skin's been like very like textured like on my chest and I don't know what it is but I figured I would go back to this and try it because I really liked this when I used to use it for um, just any bumps that you get like where your hair touches your back you know. This is really good for that so I picked that up and I did get a little case of contact lens cases. So I don't change my contact lens case enough so I got a pack of these and the first one I pull out is missing a little head. That was weird. But anyways, yeah, so it just comes with 12 of them so I can replace them like monthly even. They are pretty inexpensive. They're like $5. So um, yeah, my eyes have been really dry lately so I'm just trying to do anything I can to prevent that. Onto the clothing. So the first thing is this Joy Lab sweatshirt that I absolutely love. It's like a neon kind of lilac color. It's super soft and I wear crew neck sweatshirts 
almost every single day like around the house or if I'm on vacation or anything like that. I can get a lot of use out of this. It's really pretty just with like either some leggings, lounging, or some boyfriend jeans, anything like that would be perfect. And this was $29. So this was the most expensive thing that I got. Joy Lab is not very cheap, but it's really nice. Next up, I got a dress from the Wild Fable line. I just thought this was so cute with like a little jean jacket in the spring. This would be adorable. It's a neutral color, which I love. Has like the buttons down the front and the um, like ruffle at the hem. I think that is gonna look adorable with like some white western booties and a denim jacket. Another like comfy lounge piece from Wild Fable. This was $22 and it's like a tie-dye pullover. Again, this just looked so like cozy and summery and I'm just like in that vibe where you wanna buy everything that looks like spring and summer cause you're just excited. I like the sort of unfinished hemline. I think that's really unique and pretty. Then I got this chiffon top right here. That is gorgeous. It does not look like it would be from Target. I love it. It was $20. So it has like the smocked body and then the flowy sleeves. And it's like a pink floral. Absolutely adorable. I also picked up these hot pink biker shorts. I've been seeing a lot of people share these and they look so cute. And I have a oversized like white um, crew neck from American Eagle that the... the that I think would look really cute with those in the spring. I also got a shirt for Patrick. I'm not so selfish on these shopping trips. Um, I got him this shirt that he loves. I got him one that has, that was like a Hawaiian print and I think I got him one with bananas on it. He loves these um, Goodfellas shirts from Target. They're like so freaking soft and I love them on him. So I picked him up a new one. They had a bunch of new ones out and I thought he would like this black one with the palm trees. I know he won't really be able to wear this until the summertime, but um, I still thought it was cute. So I picked it up now. Those are like $20. I also picked up this little black t-shirt that just has the ruffle hem down there. This is also by Wild Fable. Again, just like a little basic, but it has like an interesting detail. That was only $12. And then the very last thing is just a t-shirt from the Universal Thread brand. This look totally reminds me of like Madewell or something. It's just like a washed cropped t-shirt. Actually, I don't even think it'll be that cropped. But again, I live in stuff like this in the summertime. It's just so comfortable, easy to throw on, and you can dress it up or down. So I love that. But that is everything that I got at Target. I had so much fun buying all of these spring pieces. Um, I have to try it on and see if I need to return anything. But yeah, we will see. <music> with my little workout if you will even call it a workout it was really just a dumbbell routine um, for my arms so I like to do that on days that I don't have time to do like a full hour-long workout that just took me like 30 minutes and I basically just did like three to four sets of 12 with 10 pound dumbbells I did bicep curls bent over rows and um, shoulder raises anyways that was super easy and then i usually do abs before bed me and patrick are trying to do like an ab challenge so we'll see how that goes i'm um, doing that every night before bed but now i'm gonna get started on dinner because my parents should be here at like 7 30 it is 7 5 now so i'm going to make chicken fajitas i figured that would be easy i'm just going to basically marinate the chicken really quick and then um, put the bell peppers, onion, and chicken in a skillet. And then we can have rice on the side with tortillas and sour cream and salsa and everything like that. So that's what I'm gonna do now. <laughs>
I am getting ready for work. I'm going to do my makeup a little bit more than I normally would just to go to work because Patrick and I do have plans right after work to um, shoot a couple of photos for me and then we are going out to dinner and to the movies with his parents. So if I ever have plans like right after work, I usually just do my makeup in the morning like how I would for, you know, going out. That way I don't have to touch up really at all. So like I said, today I'm just going into our new office. I keep thinking it's Wednesday to get today, guys. Like, do you guys ever do that where there's literally no reason at all? It's like, I didn't skip a day. Like, there's no reason why I should feel like it's Wednesday. But my body just woke up and thought it was Wednesday. So I'm about to leave for work. This is my outfit for today. Um, I am allowed to dress pretty casual for my job, especially like on days when I don't have meetings. So I'm just wearing jeans, uh, these little tennis shoes because I'm gonna be moving stuff today. So I want to be comfortable. So that is the outfit. And I have my work bag over here. It is pretty full. Water bottle that I need to fill up before I leave because there's not a water fountain there. Then I just have to pack my lunch really quick. Our dog, Archie, has been wanting to get things off of the counter and eat them, so I have to always do like a final sweep of the counters to make sure there's nothing he can reach that he would get into. He's already scavenging. Archie, what are you doing? Bye, I love you, have a good day. Wednesday and I just wanted to sit and catch up because I forgot to film last night and um, I've just been running around this morning so I didn't film this morning either. Um, I think I ended the vlog with maybe a clip of me in the office working. Yesterday was one of those days you guys where I just was not in a good mood. I was not having it. I don't know why like it's one of those things where like there you can't really pinpoint like there's no specific reason for me to be in a bad mood. I was just annoyed all day long. Anyways, I let the dogs in so you can probably hear them. But around 4.30, I left and came home. And then I got together a couple of outfits and um, Patrick took photos for me. But I didn't even film that. So I will insert the pictures that he took maybe. But they're on my Instagram. So if you are following me on Instagram, then um, you may have already seen those. Then we had dinner at Cheddar's with his family, and then we went and saw the movie, A Call, The Call, Call of the Wild or something like that, about the dog. It was pretty good, it was like pretty unrealistic, but if you just want like a good movie about like, I don't know, a dog in the wilderness and like dogs descending from wolves is kind of what it's about. Um, then maybe you would like it but it was pretty interesting so this morning i am working from home because my mom is out of town i don't know if i already mentioned that but she's out of town she's only like an hour away doing a phd program but she asked me if i could take one of her dogs to the vet and she likes me to just pick them up and so they can play with my dogs so they get a little bit of exercise so that's what I did. So I went and got her two dogs, Winston and Bennett. I'm sure if you guys watch me a lot or follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen them. It's like a full-time job having four dogs at your house. So I'm staying home, working from home today. There's a lot of emails I need to send and creating some graphics and things like that. I'm kind of like working a half day though. I definitely probably won't be working all day because I also need to get some stuff done for 
YouTube and all of that. That is the plan for today. Alrighty guys, now I'm going to fix lunch. It is noon and all I had for breakfast was a little granola bar and I am starving. But I wanted to show you guys these. I had one of these for breakfast. They're the whenever bars. These are so good. They are so yummy. I got them off of Thrive Market. I wonder if you can get them somewhere else. I wonder if you can get them at Target. They're from Pamela's. I got the oat peanut butter chocolate chip. And they have eight grams of whole grains. They're supposed to be like really healthy and all of that. And then for lunch, I'm just going to make a super healthy lunch. Not This is just a lean cuisine um, Vermont white cheddar mac and cheese. I'm just going to fix that and then I'm going to eat this bowl of fruit and see how I feel and if I'm still hungry I can have chicken. That is what I will do. Such an appetizing meal. <laughs> you know what I think would be good though is if you cooked up some like grilled chicken tender sort of things and then put buffalo sauce and the chicken in here and made it like a buffalo chicken mac and cheese. That would be very good. But by the time I cook the chicken, this will probably be cold. So I'm just going to eat this as is. All right, guys, there has been a change of plans. So pretty much I was going to just deal with my greasy hair and get through the day and just do what I needed to do and film what I needed to film. But then I just like felt so gross. So I just wanted to wash my hair. And then I thought, okay, well, I could go ahead and apply myself tanner now. So what I usually do is take a shower, wash my hair, apply myself tanner, um, keep it on until like 10 or 11 at night and then rinse it off right before bed because I don't really like to sleep in mine because it does get on my sheets. It doesn't stain them. You just have to wash them and it comes right out. But still, we just washed our sheets, so I didn't really want to do that. So this is the best option for me. So yeah, I'm going to apply myself tanner now. And the one I am using is this Bondi Sands Australian Tan in Ultra Dark. So I've only used this one other time, but it's pretty dark, which I want because I'm so pale right now. So I have my self tanner on but while I'm in my bedroom I wanted to show you guys how I prep for try on hauls YouTube videos packing anything like that where I have to plan like outfits there's Winston over here in the corner hi Winston but yeah so I take my husband's side of the bed and just completely take over and that clothes by outfit so like for instance this is like an American Eagle try on haul that I am doing so I have one, two, three, four, five outfits for that. And then back here is a Vici try on. So I have a pair of shoes, a hat, a pair of shoes. So one, two outfits so far. I'm getting another package from them today. And then lastly, a Target try on. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six different tops for one pair of jeans right there. So yeah, I just lay them all out like this. And then I film my try-ons right in this mirror. And then I also have a suitcase over here and then this is all stuff that I need to put away. So now I am done getting ready. I just showered, washed my hair, it feels so good. So now I'm going to go film the try-ons that I have to do today and then film a clip or two that I need to for a video that I have to edit tonight. What was I gonna say? Oh, I'm also waiting on a couple of UPS packages which is so annoying, don't you guys hate that? I'm like, when you're just like waiting on a package, you need what's in the package and you're like mm. an hour UPS guy. He usually comes at like eight, but then like yesterday he came at four. So I'm really hoping he comes at four today. Also guys, before my trip this weekend, I kind of want to redo my nails. Do you ever just like get sick of your nails and you're like, these have to be off immediately. Like that's how I'm feeling right now. I loved the lime green for a little bit, but like now... I don't know, I just want them to be gone. I want like a more neutral color. I just, I'm done with them. I think I'm gonna try to take them off tomorrow or tonight and then do them tomorrow. We will see how that goes. But yeah, that is my plan for right now. And lastly from Target, I have a cute little sundress to share with you guys. Excuse my uh, bulldog sitting right there, but I love this dress. It is so beautiful. This adorable pair of pants right here. 
These are, again, so comfortable. I feel like I say that about everything in this video, but seriously, American Eagle does comfort right, guys. Okay, so I think I'm done filming the try-ons that I can for today. I filmed one for Target and American Eagle. My Vici stuff is that UPS package I'm waiting on, so I don't think I'm gonna be able to film that today before the sun goes down. Oh my God, guys. The entire time I'm trying to film this video, my freaking parents' dog, Winston, has been doing this. Just making noises, snoring, and I know he doesn't feel good. So I took him to the vet today and he has an ear infection, so I know he doesn't feel good. But man, you are so loud. But yeah, you guys, this was one of the outfits in the try-on. These pants are from American Eagle. And I am, see, oh my god, he's just being absolutely crazy. But anyways, these pants are from American Eagle and they are so soft, so cute. And I love them with this top. This is totally going to be an outfit for me soon. I love this. How adorable. It is now 5.52. Um, I got done filming all of the try-ons. I actually was able to do um, Target and American Eagle. Did I already say this? Yes. I'm excited that I got that done and you guys have seen me in a bunch of different outfits today, but this was actually the last piece. This was in the UPS package that I was telling you guys about. Oh, and also our HelloFresh came. So I need to go unpack that. And also this is not sponsored by HelloFresh. I wish because um, I do like HelloFresh, but we just got like a coupon and a mail for it. So we have been doing it with that coupon. Patrick picked these meals out. So we have shrimp spaghetti with a kick. We have chipotle chicken and rice bowls. Those look good or ginger lime salmon, which I think is what we're gonna make tonight. Every meal that I've ever had from HelloFresh has been really yummy, so so it just comes in little bags like these. And then I think the meat is separate. Salmon, shrimp. Patrick is coming home. Now we'll probably make dinner at like 6.30. I've been like starving today. I don't know what that is about. We'll probably make dinner a little, make dinner a little earlier than usual. I just, fed the dogs and they're outside being absolutely nuts let's go see what they're doing oh, our neighbors have like a little child out there <laughs> right now i'm just going to import the footage of the video that i have to edit tonight and then um like i said we'll probably make dinner around 6 30 they're just going on and on and on and on, and on. yeah so i'll update you guys when we actually make dinner so our HelloFresh meal is in full swing. We have rice going right here, salmon going in that skillet. Patrick chopped up a lot of stuff over here, a lime, scallions, and ginger. And then in here we have broccoli. Hey, yum, yum. And dogs running wild. Here is what our meal is supposed to look like. So we will see if we can plate it the same. I think it's gonna be good. I've yet to be disappointed by HelloFresh. Yeah, not sponsored either. <laughs> okay, so here are the finished plates. We're not as good as pl at plating, but I would say they look pretty good. So just got our salmon. We charred the broccoli a little too much, but that is okay. I'm sure it is still good. Jasmine rice, sesame seeds. Looks good. All right, guys, so I haven't vlogged since dinner. It is after midnight. I'm getting in bed kind of late today. <laughs> Look at my hair. But pretty much I've just been working on editing a video. I just uh, rinsed off my spray tan. So I just basically put my hair up in a bun and then a shower cap on and just rinsed my body. I didn't like, cause I showered early, earlier, obviously. Then I just took off my makeup, did the rest of my night night routine, brush my teeth, all of that. And now I'm going to put on my pajamas and go to sleep and I will talk to you guys in the morning. Alrighty guys, just wanted to give a quick update. It is Thursday morning and I am just about to get ready for work. I'm just going to do very simple makeup, simple everything because it's just going to be legit a work day, pack day, possibly do my nails, hang out with Patrick because <coughs> I'm leaving tomorrow. One of the dogs is like choking. <laughs> Love that. Probably because he ate something stupid outside. Anyways, yeah, so not gonna do anything crazy, just going to do very simple things here. And then I'm just going to go over to my new office. I need to deposit a check today. Um, we're gonna possibly move a refrigerator into our office today. 
um, some other things like that. But yeah, I will maybe film some clips at work or, I don't know, just wherever. Like I said, today might be a little boring. Getting everything set up. This is my side of the office. So we just have, you know, a little banner. Um, I have like a few little things on my desk. Nothing crazy so far. But yeah. I have an actual desk chair coming, so I just have that one for now. And then here's Amber's side. Hers looks much cuter than mine right now, but yeah, we will get there. Alrighty guys, I am home from work on Thursday. And um, I it is 5.47. Me and Patrick were going to go tonight to move a mini fridge into our new office. But we both decided not to because he's not getting home from work tonight until like 6 or 6.15. So we're not going to do that. So right now what I'm going to do is take off my nails to just get that process started. So I have my foil here, my acetone, and my lovely cotton balls. So I'm going to use all of that and wrap my nails. So I finally got all of my nails off. My real nails look horrible, but we'll fix that later. Patrick nicely made our Hello Fresh while I was doing that, like a gem. Alrighty, so I finished my nails. Patrick's doing the dishes, if you can hear the sink in the background. But this is what they look like. I need to like take the little um, cuticle trimmer and just clean them up like around the edges. It's weird not having like long nails, but I think it'll be good to let them kind of like grow out, get a little healthier, and then they will be longer naturally. You guys, this dog is addicted to drinking water. He won't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. This 43 minutes. This is the cover of The Bachelor. Winston, the next Bachelor. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the final rose tonight, and this will be the most dramatic rose ceremony in Bachelor history. Because Winston the Bulldog, he doesn't know who's going to accept his slobber for what it is. It is 10.58, so I'm going to go do my skincare routine and go to sleep. Alrighty guys, it is Friday at 11.15. Um, I thought I was going to go into work for a half day today, but honestly, I just did not get to it, which is fine. Um, because next week I'm planning on getting a lot of stuff done for work because it's like crunch time with a couple of our events. But, um, anyways... For now, I have to take my parents' dogs back to their house. As you guys know, I said I was going to yesterday. I didn't end up taking them. So I need to take them so that when my mom gets home, they are already there so she doesn't have to stop and get them. And then I'm going to come back and film a quick Vici Dolls try-on that I want to get done. It's only six outfits, so it won't take me very long, but I need to get it up for you guys. So if you're not already following me on Instagram, then definitely do that so you don't miss those try-on hauls that I do over there. But yeah, so right now I'm just going to pack up their stuff and run them over there, come back, do that. I need to ship something today, and then if my video from my editor is back, then I will go ahead and upload that really quick before I leave. All right, y'all, I just got home, and I went by CVS, and I picked up one of these celsius drinks i've heard so much about them but i have never tried one and i did not know cvs had them so i picked one up this is the smart sparkling watermelon it is so good oh my god so yummy i had to get a bunch of stuff tampons of course gotta have that I don't know if this is new or not. You guys can tell me, but this is the Batiste Volumizing Dry Shampoo. I usually use the Brunette um, Batiste Dry Shampoo, but I don't know if this one is new, but I definitely need volume. Had to get a deodorant. This is the Dove Even Tone. I've been using another Dove that didn't have um, aluminum in it, but TBH, guys, sometimes you just need a regular deodorant, okay? I had to get a new one of my Carbon Black L'Oreal Telescopic. Got some Airborne in case anyone on this girl's trip 
needs a little immune system support. I got these uh, travel size shampoo and conditioner just in case I need to wash my hair on this trip. And then while I was there, I saw they had two new lip products. So I got two lip products randomly. The first one is from Maybelline. So that is what it looks like. It looks very pretty. So we'll have to test that out. And then this is like a lip crayon, matte lip crayon. Kind of weird though. I don't know, we'll have to test it out. Random quick little CVS haul there. It is now three o'clock on Friday. I'm about to leave here in like 30 minutes. I got everything done that I needed to get done. I got my parents' dogs back, got my Vici try on, uh, filmed, got my bag packed, got my video uploaded. Um, the dogs are outside now, so they are all taken care of. I need to get them water before I leave. Yeah, so I am on a roll. I am just getting things done. The only other things that I wanted to do before I left are I have to go get a swimsuit because I need to ship that from Poshmark. And then I was possibly going to upload a try on today from my house because the internet is really good here. But yeah, other than that, I think I have literally everything, so I am good to roll out the door. There's no denying what we want. There's no denying what we want. Playing games, no. There's no denying what we want. Here is our suite at the Greenbrier. <laughs> it is gigantic. This is like a little living area. This is the biggest suite that I think I've ever stayed in. A little bar and kitchen. Here's one room. Mom, say hello. Hi. Everything's very eccentric here at the Green Bra. Another room. This is kind of weird how the doorways line up. It keeps making me think I'm in like a a circus like a fun house or something and then here is me and amber's room very cute now we're going to get ready for dinner we're eating italian tonight should be yummy oh my god i'm never staying anywhere else in the green bar but this, this place is huge it's like your own hotel inside of a hotel it is a hotel inside a hotel oh my god outfit really quick Jean, uh, leather jacket Target. This wrap dress is from Abercrombie. Shoes I think are Aldo. And then my bag is also from Target. Little edgy outfit. We're at the bar. Cheers. Everyone's quiet now that the camera's out. <laughs> it's my birthday. It's Happy Donna's birthday. birthday. Who's gonna do a toast for Donna's birthday? Mom, you're her I'm best friend. Okay. Okay, right. here we go. So Aww. Don't make us cry. Don't make us cry. You have been my forever friend since I was in fifth grade. And I don't know what I would do without you. Yay. Yay. Cheers. I love you. I love you. Yes. Stress free Thank weekend for everyone. Yes. Thank you for this. This is a peach margarita. Me, Allison, and Judy got one. Mm, they are so, so good. good. Yeah, I mean, it's That's weird because you can taste the margarita, but I've never had a like sweet margarita. I don't yeah. know. It's yeah. weird. Yeah, it's really good. It's There's very good. Kind of tart in it. Though, yeah. yeah, that's what I guess. That's what I was trying to say. Yeah. It's like sweet and sour oh, at yeah. the same time. Look at this potato uh, yeah. casserole. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Escape room. Mm -hmm. It's Titanic theme. I'm really scared. Yeah, that's right. One first class ticket, parlor suite E49, and then it says departing from Southampton April 10th, 1912. Oh my god. <laughs> what are y'all doing over there? <laughs> Me 
and mom are both videoing. I love her song. I love her song. I'm sorry. <laughs> you almost got that, Allison. You should have told him it was your birthday. <laughs> you would have got the cake. <laughs> Me. <laughs> the spring house has always been a summer of life in the Green And now Cheers. we hope you will enjoy the spring house dancers as they dance to the original composition, the Greenbrier Waltz. We are going to the Greenway on Sunday, got home, and now we are taking the dogs out because it's going to be a nice day. How cute are they? Boys. You guys look very good back there. Alrighty guys, it is Sunday at midnight and um, I wanted to come on and end this video really quickly. We got back today around 1.30 and honestly I've just been like chilling, hanging out with the dogs. Me and Patrick took them to um, like kind of like a park or like a trail where you walk and um, we can walk to a restaurant and have lunch and do all of that stuff. So that's what we did. It was really nice. We just had lunch with the dogs. They loved it and we have just been hanging out, cleaning the house a little bit. But yeah, that is what a week in my life looks like on occasion. So if you liked this video and you want me to do more vlogs like this one, then give it a thumbs up and let me know down below and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys.